China denounced a report that it asked Russia to delay invading Ukraine until after the Beijing Winter Olympics. Its foreign ministry spokesperson called the New York Times report pure fake news and a very despicable attempt to divert attention and shift blame over the conflict. The Times reported senior Chinese officials told senior Russian officials in early February not to invade Ukraine during the Winter Games and quoted US Biden administration officials and a European official who cited a Western intelligence report. Russian President Vladimir Putin met with his Chinese counterpart Xi Jinping in Beijing on the 4th of February, hours before the game's opening ceremony. Following that, the sides issued a joint statement in which they declared friendship between the two states has no limits. There are no forbidden areas of cooperation. The Times said it wasn't clear whether the communication about an invasion took place between Xi and Putin or at a lower level. China is the only major country that hasn't criticised Moscow's attack on Ukraine and has refused to call it an invasion. It has also ruled out joining the West in opposing sanctions on Russia. Instead, Beijing has endorsed the Russian argument that Moscow's security was threatened by NATO's eastern expansion. China abstained in Wednesday's UN General Assembly vote to demand an immediate halt to Moscow's attack on Ukraine and the withdrawal of all Russian troops. 141 of the Assembly's 193 members supported the resolution during a rare emergency session called by the UN Security Council, with five voting against. The overwhelming support aims to diplomatically isolate Russia at the world body. Lorraine Ferrier, NTD News.